Hello. I'm Daniel Heitch, and I'm the Chair of Statistical Science here at SMU, and I'd like to welcome you all, entering students, to uh, our new academic year, uh, August 2020, here at SMU. Let me tell you a little bit about statistics. So what is statistics? Statistics is a, a mathematical discipline that's concerned with methods for the design and analysis of studies. So those could be anything from clinical trials to industrial studies, surveys, uh, sports studies, you name it, all different kinds of research. It's a very generic enter enterprise, so statisticians are, are able to contribute to almost every kind of discipline. Statistics uh, has become increasingly popular as a, as a job uh, as the last few years have seen this uh, massive increase in our ability to collect and analyze data. So now U.S. News and World Report uh, has uh, declared us the best business job and among the top 10 uh, overall and in the STEM field. So we have several undergraduate programs here that are, that are primarily statistics or, or very much statistics. So uh, there's a statistical science bachelor's degree uh, 10 years ago, we would have maybe 10 of these students. Now we have 130, so it's really grown a lot. Also this year, SMU has uh, initiated a data science institute and a data science undergraduate degree. Well, two degrees actually. There's a bachelor of science in data science that you can earn or even minor in data science. So uh, the data science program, there's not a department of data science. This is a collaborative enterprise involving statistics, mathematics, computer science, business school. So quite a, a range of individual disciplines across campus. Uh, and you have to do that as a double major. So you could major in say statistics and data science, or you could, or you could major in anthropology and data science. But however you do it, it would involve a lot of contact with us in, in the Department of Statistical Science. We have some nice extracurricular activities here for undergraduates at SMU. One of those is the American Statistical Association Data Fest. It's a hackathon that we have every year in April. Uh, teams come in from SMU and from other universities in, in the North Texas area on a Friday evening we give them a data set and a problem to work on, and they work on that over a period of a couple of days. There are seminars from professional statisticians, uh, faculty members to help uh, enrich the experience for them. And then they make presentations at the end of that time, and we give out prizes to what we think are the best uh, uh, presentations. So that's an interesting uh, and fun activity. Uh, unfortunately, we weren't able to have it this year because of the pandemic, but we're hoping to get it going again in spring 2021. We also have a statistics club, which is just what it sounds like. It's a group of, of uh, undergraduates who get together uh, under the direction of our professor, Charles South, and talk about statistics every, every month or two during the academic year. We have 13 faculty in the Department of Statistical Science. Everybody has a PhD in statistics. Uh, we also have some adjuncts who help us with the teaching. Uh, faculty members are skilled teachers. They also have research interests in a range of areas. You can see on this slide, we have a faculty member who's interested in environmental sampling. We have one who's uh, really interested in uh, Bayesian approaches and, and uh, analyzing genetic and other high throughput kinds of data. We have one professor who's a very skilled mathematician who works primarily in stochastic processes, has written, written a book in that area. My research area, I'm coming out of the biostatistics world, so I have a lot of interests in those topics, particularly clinical trials. It's not too early to start thinking about what you'll be doing when you graduate from SMU, and we'd like you to uh, kind of contemplate our graduate programs. We uh, offer a master's degree called the Mazda degree, Master's in Applied Statistics and Data Analytics. You can do that either by completing your uh, undergraduate degree and then, t and then going through a regular two years, two year program. Or some students uh, will do that as a, in, in a kind of a four plus one mode. So you only have to take one year of additional courses, but then of course you have to start taking graduate courses while you're still in college, particularly or presumably when you're a senior. 
So that requires a little bit more planning, but many students do that. We also have a PhD in statistical science for people who want to pursue that. A uh, typical pathway there would be to go into an academic career or in some cases a business career. Also, we have a, a new program. Our newest program is PhD in biostatistics. The curriculum is very similar to the PhD in statistical science, but during the research years, the students go over to the University of Texas Southwestern Medical Center here in Dallas and work on biomedical research projects as part of their dissertation research. So we look forward to having you join us in August. Please come see us. I know many of you will be taking our courses. We wish you the best. Uh, we'd like to have lots of interaction and uh, that four years is gonna go by very quickly. Pretty soon you're gonna be like these young people here throwing their hats in the air. And we hope we can help make, make that an enriching and pleasant experience for you. Best wishes. See you in August.